This video is sponsored by Little Stinker Septic for your septic tank clean out and porta potty rentals. Call Little Stinker Septic at 719-859-5009. What's up everybody? This is Air Creed Harry and today I'm going to be going over the steps that I took to create this air form for a 16 foot diameter dome. Here we go. So what you see here is masonite board in the shape of a gore pattern with a two inch seam line on either side. And the white material that you see here is Tyvek house wrap material that I've taken. I've cut out the pattern using that template you just saw to make all of my gore patterns that I need to make a 16 foot diameter dome. So in this part you just see me sewing up my uh, air form patterns which are gore templates. Here I'm sewing a rope onto the bottom part of the air form. This rope is going to help hold the air form down to the foundation so on this step here I'm taking angle iron bar and I'm drilling holes in it and the holes that I'm drilling in here are going to be used to mount this part to the foundation and this is what is going to hold the air form down to the foundation so I have them spaced at a certain distance that I need so that they have the strength to hold the air form down and the next process is going to be to cut the slits into the angle iron here that's going to allow me to bend the bar and the arc that I need it bent to So here you see my buddy Dan and I mounting my air form down to the slab foundation that I created. And I'm just using wood screws to hold it down. That's one of the benefits of Aircrete and Epic. This slab is Epic. You can screw into it. I've done this slab before out of concrete and having to hammer drill and use tabacons is a pain in the butt. Uh, the benefit of being able to screw a wood screw right into the foundation is I just love it. So here the air form has been mounted to the foundation and we're filling it through an inflation tube that was pre-mounted into the slab. This process of watching an air form being inflated for the first time is called the birthing. It's like you're giving birth. It looks pretty cool. So anyway, that's going to be it for now. Come back for part two of the dome build.